Kong, we are celebrating the 50th anniversary of hip hop. And our next guest is one of the most inspirational success stories of the genre. Yeah, the soundtrack of my college career there. <laughs> he changed the game and set a new path, not only for himself, but for generations to follow. And we are so delighted to have him with us today. Please help us welcome to the GMA3 studio, five-time Grammy Award winning hip hop mogul, Percy Miller, AKA Master P. <laughs> to see you, man, and always clean as ever. You know what I liked about you back in the day, uh, of course, aside from your music, you were one of the first ones to put on a suit and have this sort of corporate look about you and build an empire. Are you surprised at your impact now? Well, you know, it all started with education. So I just thank God, thank the man up above for changing me, uh, for developing me to who I am today and not being afraid to grow and change and get better. So that's what this is about. But education was the key for me. And so when we talk about 50 years of hip hop, I want people to know how much we done grew. Mm -hmm. I don't want people just to uh, stereotype us as that we can't evolve into businessmen. But I did start as a young person. That, that, was, that was the goal. And when you talk about where hip hop has grown into today, what, how do you feel about that perspective? I mean, half a century, and where do you think it's heading in the future? Well, I love it. I mean, when I look at Snoop, he's probably one of the most famous entertainers when you talk about hip hop and now to be able to do business and to create uh, other revenues for you because you, it's like playing basketball you only could play for so long but when you get older it's like what are you gonna do uh, but hip hop has gone into business now people are getting into other things and saying you know we can grow we can evolve and uh, it's just a blessing it's a blessing because now we are creating things that we can pass down from generation to generation so uh, I feel like hip hop has been there for 50 years. It's gonna be here even longer. So they thought, they did, people probably thought hip hop was gonna be around for about five years. It's been around for a lot yeah. longer than that. Yeah. It yeah. continues mm -hmm. to grow. You talked about Snoop yes. and all of the business stuff that you guys were doing. One of the things you guys have launched together is a cereal line, which I can see yes. just right off over, there. <laughs> over there. Yes. Uh, you guys have put this together. Talk to us about this. Well, you know, when they talk about cereal, uh, I grew up on WIC, my grandparents was to make sure that I had cereal, Snoop, the same thing, and now to be able to have a brand that we could feed kids on WIC and show them, look how far we come. Uh, but it's all, always been about great tasting cereal. And starting this business, me and Snoop said, uh, this is Broder's Food, his family name. We're building family names. We look at Kellogg's, Post, all these different companies. These are family names. I'm like, why we haven't been done this? Mm -hmm. And so now we got amazing cereal by us for the world. I mean, this it's black owned. Okay. Yeah, also building generational wealth. Generational wealth. wealth. Ooh, I'm so glad right. the one I have with the a question for yes. you. Are you a milk first, then cereal person, or a cereal, then add the milk person? I love both. Without <laughs> and with. Mm. See? It's really good. That's what I'm saying, y'all. And I, I just, I just want to thank Post for believing in diversity because this is national uh, distributed, distributed all over the world, all, all the stores all over. So this is great. Uh, this has never happened been a hundred years to where African-American actually own the product because we consume a lot of this product, but we never own it. Master P, great Master to have P. you with us. How it's the cereal taste? It's, oh, it's good. Amazing. Also, there's See? marshmallows in this one. I felt like I got Okay, you got cinnamon <laughs> toasties. And I have these, these guys. See? Yes. This, this, that's what this is about. Mm -hmm. Go in stores, buy this, purchase it. We're changing the game, and it's only going to get better. We, we're going to come up with organic cereal next. And Mama Snoop oatmeal is coming. Ooh. So, Mama okay, Snoop we'll take it. Uh, Snoop cereal will be available in stores nationwide June 25th. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.